we're gonna talk about deadlifts. Deadlifts is one hell of an exercise for your back. Not just your back, but it's an overall physique building exercise if you do it right. You know, you can work on your glutes, you can work on your hamstrings, on your legs, on your back, on your traps, but you need to do it right. I don't advise that to a lot of people if you are new to the gym, because of course the technique is so hard sometimes and it uh, requires a lot of attention that you might want to have some expertise before jumping into this exercise. But let me actually explain to you what a deadlift is and where it actually works. We actually lift the bar from the floor, we pick it up, and we lift it until we're actually standing with a straight position of our back. Of course, uh, the first thing that you should take into account is to have your back straight. We work in back, so the back should be in the perfect position, not to get injured, not to get any problems or any issue with it. That's one of the best exercises to build thickness on your back. If you want to build a big back, thick back, go with deadlifts. Let's go over the most common mistakes that people do while performing a deadlift at the gym. First mistake that people do is to round their back. If you want to pick it up your bar, first, before doing anything on the deadlift, just keep your chest high up, close your shoulders, and then we start to perform the movement. Even on your way up, at the maximum point where you're standing straight, your chest should be high. So if you look at me from the side, when I come up with my bar, then my chest is here and my shoulders are back there, close together. Remember, don't round your back, keep it straight, keep it powerful, and really work in it. So the second mistake is straightening your legs first. Some people just straight their legs before they stand up right. And that's wrong because we put in a lot of effort on our back, on our lower back, which actually can cause some injuries and is risky for you. So you should straight your back together with your legs and come up to a straight position. So if we start from the floor and we're coming up, I'm actually getting straight legs together with my back. So when my back is straight, I'm actually knowing that my legs are straight too. Don't straight your leg before your back, just do everything at the same time to have a right technique. Third mistake that people do is at the starting point. At the starting point when we're picking up the bar from the floor, of course your shins need to be close to the bar. If we're actually too far from the bar with our shins, then that actually forces us to round our back. And as you remember on the first mistake that I told you, that's completely wrong. So go with your shins closer to the bar, try to actually get your knees over your feet. Fourth mistake, keeping your feet too wide. I know it's easier to go lower if your feet are wide apart. Some people can do it, they call it sumo deadlifts, but that's not our focus here. They're working just on their hamstrings more, but here we want to work on our back. So a good fit stance should be as wide as your shoulders. You can actually tip your tiptoes a little bit out, like maybe 45 degrees out angle, just to help the movement. Remember not to go too wide with your feet, just to work in more on your back than on your hamstrings. Fifth mistake is the wrong breathing. Breathing is so important in every exercise, but in deadlift especially, you want to breathe right to actually have 100% benefit from the exercise. What I usually do and advise people to do is to breathe in when you're at the top and then perform the whole movement. And once you're down on your way back up, just breathe out. So I would breathe in here, go down, and then on the way down when I reach the standing point, then I would push back up, breathing out. So to have more power to pull up the bar and come back to a straight position. So that's the right breathing technique for deadlifts. So remember to breathe at the top and breathe fully. These were the most common mistakes people do while performing deadlifts. I hope it was helpful and please remember to stay active. Comment down below if you have any other doubts or questions and please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more exercises. See you next time.